Hello viewer. Okay, so this one picks up right after the last uh, video ended. And we're just about to head up to uh, Rate. Yeah. And we're going to check on the tournament first. I think it's probably too late in the day to enter that. But just in case it's not, we'll make that the first stop. No, actually, we'll make that the second stop. I gotta forget some armor fixed. With salt, caraway seeds, garlic, and more, you'll find it nowhere else. I'm honored that you should come to me. You should be honored. You know what? I'm only going to do the one. I'll pay him and then I'm going to buy some armor and kits. Five hundred. Uh, I'm not paying that. I'm going to haggle him down a little bit. Let's have a word about the price. Well, we can try it. Is this enough? Come now. Just a little more and we have a deal. They always want just a little more. Finally, a reasonable sum. Now, let's see if I can't repair up my stuff. Okay, so my armor should all be good. Need a cobbler kit, which I don't think I have. So that's the next Garlic, stop. Carrots, beetroot, onions, all that grows in the ground, fresh. Come right up. Yeah. What happened to you? You look like you've been assaulted. Many times, dude. Many times. God be with you. Let's have a word about the price. Hmm. All right, so. Is this enough? That's not enough. How is that not enough? That's a plenty big offer. All right, so. Sometimes I think these people are just trying to be contrary. <laughs> now, I could have just paid him to fix it, but I wanted to uh, level up the skill. The higher it gets, the more repairs you can do to your stuff.
Greetings. What business have you? I'd like to enroll in the big tournament. You've come too late, lad. We're all full up. Better look next time. Damn it. Take care. Too late in the day. Meeting face to face in this round will be Benish of Lashim. Cut pole to the Sasso Bailiff. And he will face Darius, commander of the guard at Tomberg. Let us wish the combatants luck. And I think they only have these every couple of weeks. All right, well, while I'm here, I might as well get sworn in as the bailiff. What's the process for that? Take the letter to the Rate bailiff. Yeah. Yeah. There's a tailor here. What do you need? I've been based out of this town forever and I did not know there was a tailor here. Good luck then. Damn it. Okay, so I guess the bailiff's up on the second floor. Talk to me, you jackass. I have a document for you from Sir Divis. It concerns the renewal of Pribis Labits. The village you drove those bandits out of? Very same. So it's true then. Good. Good. Let me see that document then. Here it is. So what have we here? Hmm. Hmm. It says I should announce that anyone interested may move to Pribislavitz to live and work. And Sir Radzig and Sir Hanush also give their consent. Hmm. In that case, let's not waste any time. Come along with me. God be with you. See the way she was gliding across the ground without moving her feet? That seems like witchcraft to me. I gotta keep an eye on that one. Good people, come up close and have a smell. Fresh bread. And pour yourself a bit of fresh milk to drink. Hear ye, hear ye. It is hereby announced, in the name of Sir Hanush and Sir Divish, that you, the citizens of Ratai, as well as those who have found temporary refuge here, are permitted to move to the hamlet of Pribislavitz, to the north of Tomberg Castle, wherein you shall be vouchsafed a new life and new dwellings, providing that you shall contribute to the renewal of the hamlet. All those who choose to accept this offer shall be exempted from payment of taxes for a period of five years. They shall be permitted also to make use of timber from the surrounding woods and water from the streams. 
The hamlet of Pribislavitz lies in the domain of Sir Divish of Kalmberg, and all who settle there shall be duty-bound to him. It is furthermore hereby announced that Henry of Skalitz is appointed to the administration of Pribislavitz and the office of bailiff therein, which office and privilege have been conferred upon him by Sir Divish for loyalty and services rendered. I would therefore recommend that our Scarlet's friends consider this offer very seriously, as nothing better is likely to come your way anytime soon. Jesus Christ be praised. How may I serve you? How does life in Ratai suit you? It would be fine if we didn't have to sleep in hovels and beg for arms. And the bailiff is always on our backs, the bastard. But what can we do? We've got nowhere else to go. Were you not just listening? God be with you. So, I think while I'm here, I'm going to brew up some extra potions. God be with you. We'll buy up all his belladonna. That should get me... No, I do not want to exit the bad shop. <laughs> now, I got a perk that allows me to auto-brew stuff. I should be able to get three at a time out of this. And it's way faster. So an extra three save games. That should be an extra six. Okay, uh, yeah, I guess that's all I got enough for. Because I don't have the Belladonna. I'm sure I still have the medals though. And is there anything else that I need while I'm here? One Belladonna. Dollmaker we got tons of. Lather of Potion. Marigold Decoction. Poison, I still got plenty of. Alright, I guess I'm good for the time being. Now, I do have some bandit leader spurs, so I could go give those to uh, Captain Bernard. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he must have heard the evening bell and went home. Now, I think I know whose horse this is.
I always end up getting into trouble with this guy. Good day, Henry. Yeah, just as you ordered. Please what? bring me something to eat. Well, I hope he's talking to her. Okay, it looks like Hans has got no missions for this time. Keeps talking about that bandit camp, but I'm pretty sure they're no longer a thing. <coughs> Even so, let's go check it out. Maybe they've respawned. Yeah. I think it's a glitch. I can't seem to get the bandit leader's spurs, yeah. which I need for the uh, completion of the mission. Yeah. Narrow bridge. Yeah. 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 Seems to indicate this guy is the leader. Not especially sporting, but I need to get my bow skill up a little. What's going on? Th
Okay, well, it's certainly ironic that they run away from me now. Although, to be fair, I'm using poison arrows, too. Poison arrows, so they are losing a ton of their health just by getting hit once. I needed boar skins. Who doesn't like a little mint for their morning tea? Okay, well I don't see that guy that I shot with the uh, arrow. supposed to think of this accident site. Now, somebody told me that if you sneak into one of the houses near the church, that they have a, like a lost and found box there. And if you miss the bandit leader and you don't uh, loot him properly, sometimes the stuff ends up there. And I suppose it would theoretically be possible to go try yeah. that. But that would require a little bit of thievery, and I'd have to wait until it gets particularly dark. No 
Your little horse has got pretty bright uh, ears when you see him at night, eh? Like you're painted with that 3M reflective paint. Like a highway sign or something. Okay, so it says it's in there. I'm just going to go chill out for a little bit. <coughs> Holy crap, that almost never works. I say almost never, I mean it's never once worked where I didn't have to use the mouse to actually click on that. Okay, so it's 1 a.m. Now I gotta drop my noise down to zero. Visibility is still up at 46.
I'm over encumbered. So I gotta move some of this stuff to the horse. Okay, so it's in this corner of the room. just in case things go sideways here. So far, so good. It's all just a bad dream.
she just misplaced her keys. All right, now I'm out of there. I can go back to being all respectable and shit. Now, I could go back to the Rate Mill, which is, ah, uh, yeah, why don't I do that? I was awarded a room at the lower castle, but this will give me the opportunity to uh, sell off some of my excess loot in the morning. And we wake up, pouring rain, have a bit of brekkie, put the torch away. And I think that's going to do it for this episode. So I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, come back for the next one if you want to see more.